Hey beloveds, welcome to Beanie TV where I offer you sprinkles of spiritual sassiness. So welcome to my March favorites video. Um, I'm going to try to do this monthly because there's a lot of stuff that I love. So this one is going to be centered around holistic, organic, natural health. You know, um, just really like getting into the body and making sure that we are giving the temple all that it needs and most of it needs to be from the earth. Okay, so right now I created this little detox drink. It is aloe vera juice, water, a little bit of cayenne pepper. I put too much. My heart is on fire. Cayenne pepper and honey and lemon and I let it sit overnight. My heart is on fire but this is what I'm gonna start drinking first thing in the morning first thing in the morning you know I either I'm too lazy to do the hot water lemon thing so in the first thing in the morning I'll either drink like just straight up water and let it flush the body naturally and I'm gonna be um, drinking this first thing in the morning so yeah I will write down what I'm drinking in the description box below but let's get started on my March favorites, all thing natural, organic, holistic. First things first is this aloe vera juice from Trader Joe's. It is seven or eight dollars. Back in the day, four years ago, my mom and my brother were totally into drinking aloe vera and my mom would buy the aloe vera plant, squeeze it out, boil it, drink it, and I'd be like, that's too much. That looks like we don't live in the jungle. I can't like she's chopping up the leaves I can't no I can't um so I I don't know if um Trader Joe's has always had this like that's where I go grocery shopping obviously um but I picked it up and I was like okay I need to introduce my body to something new like the smoothies are cool the vitamins are cool blah 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 but I'm like okay let me introduce something new so this is my second jug um now the thing with aloe vera juice it is not sweet it has this um carbon kind of like bubbly thing going on it's not bitter but it's not sweet but it also doesn't taste like nothing um it helps support a healthy immune system gastrointestinal support helps maintain and promote healthy digestion and regularity muscle and joint support helps sustain normal muscle tissue and joint functions oral hygiene Helps maintain healthy gums, mouth, and throat environment. Just sip, gargle, and swallow. Do I feel any differences? I'm not 100% sure. I'm not 100% sure, to be honest with you guys. But I am happy that I am bringing this into my body. And um, yeah, I'll let you guys know Like if I feel... Um, if I feel any different and also I'm reading here it has citric acid so that's what that carbon bubbly stuff is which is a pH stabilizer and you guys know pH balance is super important um, especially in women especially in our um, with our vagina and our reproductive system pH balance is key so guys when I made this video I was gonna talk about this brand of pads called Bella Fleur but then when I went to Target this day that I shot the video, they didn't have them. But they did have these amazing, beautiful pads. They are, the brand is called L, And they are chlorine-free, ultra-thin pads. No pesticides, rayon, fragrances, deodorants, or dyes. They are made in Italy. They are 6 to $7. And every pack of pads you purchase, they send a pack of pads to a girl in a developing country. Sometimes in developing countries when a girl has her period and her family is poor, she has to miss out on school for an entire week. So not only is this pad environmentally friendly, body friendly, but it is also friendly to girls and women all over the world. So I encourage you guys to get this. It's at Target. They also make tampons. And I mean, look at this packaging. It's like fancy vagina Italian looks for your underwear okay so back to the video thanks guys something really quick um you know guys we're coming into a really beautiful time in the world where we are awakened to so much information that <coughs> excuse me it's that cayenne pepper from the, the um the detox drink <coughs> 
but we're coming into so much information that there's no need to continue doing what you used to do because that's the only thing you know, you know? Um, so if you're still using tampons and pads that are from like big name brands, do understand that you are putting bleach into your body. You're putting chlorine into your body. Like you're putting all of these chemicals that they put into the tampons and the pads into your body. Don't act like our skin does not absorb the things that we put on, especially our vagina. It's a muscle and it's, it's, it's delicate and we need to take care of it. And yes, I used to use big name brands because that's only what I knew, but I'm... I'm like getting over that, you know what I mean? I'm just saying like, okay, it's time to do something different. I'm actually interested in the Diva Cup. The only thing that strayed me away from the Diva Cup, which is, you know, the cup that you insert in there, is that I have a uh, tilted uterus or a retroverted uterus, meaning that my uterus faces, um, I don't know, up, no, back. I think my uterus faces back. 30% of women have it. If you have a tilted uterus, hey, welcome to the club. Um, no, a tilted uterus does not mean that it makes it difficult to have kids if that's your thing, whatever. But with the Diva Cup, my gynecologist was like, you know, it's a 50-50 whether you're going to feel comfortable. But I was talking to my coworker yesterday. She has a tilted uterus. Welcome to the tilt. And she has a Diva Cup. She's been using it for three years, guys. So I'm like, okay, I'm in. I'm buying it. Back to these, but in the meantime, I will be using pads. I'm not a fan of tampons. Like, I will use them sparingly. It's not my favorite thing. The body needs to flow. The uterus lining of the wall, the uterus wall lining is shedding and it needs to get out. Like, the thing about tampons is that when the blood clots are coming out and it's just basically stuck up there because the tampon, you can't release it. I don't like that feeling and and that's another thing if you get a lot of yeast infections you might need to switch up your tampons and pads because those have perfume in it because society wants us to think that our vaginas smell no the vagina is an organ and you think organs smell like freaking roses no it smells like organ and meat and blood and yeah so if you're um Susceptible to yeast infections, definitely I recommend switching over to the natural holistic organic side. Next, we're moving on to toothpaste. Um, Tom's, I know Tom's is owned by a big corporation, so Tom's is not like the ideal natural organic um, toothpaste. I am going to be moving on to something way more organic and natural as time goes on, but for now, this is what I'm doing. Um, so this one, I actually grabbed this by accident, but... I am loving what it makes my teeth feel like. So this is anti-plaque and whitening. I don't like licorice at all, so I've had to get, like, become accustomed to this flavor. But when I tell you my teeth feel super clean throughout the day, I am absolutely going to be using this before I move on to, like, just straight up brushing my teeth with like charcoal like I'm not there yet y'all I'm not there yet but I'm here but I absolutely recommend this one the fennel my teeth feel so clean all the time next is this raw shea butter that I got from Ghana you guys know I've been trying to get you guys onto this but what I will say is you know this is the shea butter they use on babies like born and raised in Ghana that's why our skin is so beautiful so luscious there's no there's no Johnson and Johnson there's no like you're not using baby lotion or yeah you're not using baby lotion and baby oil on babies you're using shea butter and cocoa butter okay um I will say I have seen a huge difference in the the texture of my skin the how my complexion just looks my skin is so soft and supple and it has something to do with the shea butter like straight from Ghana, you know, um, yeah, my skin looks like even better. You guys are always complimenting my skin, my skin, my skin. Well, I have very dry skin and this has been just really transforming my skin, especially like my elbow area, my feet like this. Yeah, like this is super of the motherland. I'm noticing just this beautiful, like, um, 
evenness in my skin and this really beautiful glow I see on my body. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, I'm definitely selling these for $10 right now. So be sure to DM me, message me, whatever. I'm more than happy to ship these within the United States. 10 bucks for this 7 ounce container of raw shea butter from Ghana. You will thank me, you will thank me, you will thank me. And last but not least, my soulmate put me onto this. This is my Syntex Diffuser. I got it off Amazon. It came out to $25. So basically, this you... I'm trying to look for a plug for y'all. Let me plug it in. So, you plug it in, right? And this one lights up. And you just press the button. And then you put, pour water in here and you pour your essential oil. So right now I'm using tea tree, which is a great diffuser. I'm sorry, a great purifier of the air. But you can use orange oil. You can use Ling Lang. You can use whatever you want. And I run this during the night. And when I tell you I can breathe, I can breathe. Let me turn this off real quick. Um, when I tell you guys. When I tell you guys I can breathe, I can breathe. The pollution in LA is very serious. When you move to LA, you're going to realize that your breathing is different and your skin is going to get drier because it's very dry air, very polluted air out here. So I turn the diffuser on at night or in the daytime when I'm just like at home, I can breathe. Especially in my old apartment, I couldn't breathe that well. So I had bought like a humidifier, but this is a diffuser purifies the air i use my tea tree oil i got this from like marshall's or target but you can get this at uh whole foods um and you can get it online on amazon all right guys so that was those were my march favorites natural organic holistic i hope you guys you know um really just it takes small changes small changes now am i perfect no did i order domino's pizza and ate the entire thing by myself yes and did i eat like the brownie cookie that they cake that comes with the pizza yes like i'm not perfect i'm not like oh all natural all organic no because i grew up on fucking mcdonald's like so there's still parts of me i'm transitioning out of but it's the little things, you know, introducing my mom to smoothies has literally saved her life, you know, introducing her to um, natural toothpaste, introducing my family to just natural organic products has absolutely made a difference in our in our lives and in our lifestyles and we can feel the change. So if you're using big name like toothpaste, get rid of it. It's the small things. So I hope this. Um, I hope you guys purchase these things and make your lives a little bit better. Um, if you guys want to talk about periods and vaginas and things like that, I'm totally about that. Um, I think I have some like gems to drop about the yoni. You know. Um, again, if you want to purchase the uh, shea butter for ten bucks, only right now, limited time only. Um, be sure to DM me and I'd be more than happy to ship it to you within the United States. I thank you guys for tuning in. Links are below and uh, stay blessed. Peace.